All right, hello everyone again. Um, it's kind of cool. Look on the videos and already see that I get a bunch of video viewers, and I don't really actually try to advertise my videos or anything. Like I don't even share to Facebook, so it's kind of cool. Thanks for watching. A um, little bit of humility uh, goes a long ways. Uh, I mean, it's the whole reason why I post on YouTube is to try to help people, like show them that there is a better way, there's an easier way. Um, I kind of wanted to hit on some things. Like, I, I've i already lived in an RV for two years. And I did it with uh, my girlfriend for those for three years during that time, the before and during. Um, that was, it, it was an experience in being broke and having money and being broke and wanting to do stuff. Like, to, to just move straight in, like this RV, it's a 26 foot Jamboree, um, 2000, it, um, uh, it was sitting for six years, um, the person who owned it ended up hurting themselves in a car accident or something, and they couldn't use it, so they put it in storage and it sat there for six years, so, and it had a half tank of gas still in it, so we ended up dumping all of our money we had and some money we, well, a lot of money we really didn't have, and we got everything fixed up to where to run, and we was like, all right, let's go. We're in an RV. Let's just go travel. And we were poker dealers at the time, living in Vegas, and we're like, let's just go travel and deal poker. Cool beans. So, I mean, it really wasn't that hard um, to leave and travel and deal poker. Um, there's always the circuit events going on, so we could be a modern-day gypsy. Um, I got tired. I was wore out. I've been dealing poker for 10 years, it, yeah, it's all fun and whatever, I'm done with it, I want a little slower pace, I don't want to work, like, I don't want to show up and work the long hours and really not make as much money as you think you should, um, and the money just keeps getting less and less every time, and I'm just like, well, I can make this much money doing something else that I like to do. I don't like to do this anymore. I feel like a freaking babysitter at the poker table most of the time. And I'm just... Whatever. I'm, I'm done with it. I like playing poker. I still will play every now and then. Um, I actually will incorporate in my travels. I'm actually going to show how easy it is to go from... Sorry, the lighting. I should have made it a little brighter here. I hope you don't mind the, the bright background with the talking head up here. Um, I'm hoping not all my videos are going to be talking heads. Don't, don't think that it's always just going to be looking at this beard every day and this crooked hat. I always like, I always wear my hats crooked. Don't ask me why. I just, I'm different like that, I guess. Um, I used to never wear hats too. And now I just always have them around. Um, oh yeah, you, you more than likely on any YouTube video they make, cause that's usually when I'm comfortable. Uh, it's you're going to see me in a hat, so, and it's always going to be crooked, <laughs> but, <clears throat> wow, total segue, and derailed, so we ended up moving into this thing, and traveling, dealing poker, and, and I do apologize, I will segue a lot, for no reason, um, I like to talk and ramble, um, I guess it's a good thing for someone on YouTube, you never really, I might actually segue into an interesting subject that someone really didn't think about, yeah, otherwise it's just boring stories. Um, yeah. I, there's got to be a term for that. But we left. We didn't get all the repairs done at all on this thing. Um, the we it, it it's a weird thing when you're traveling and you still need repairs in the RV. Um, they you want emergency money. And you gotta replace the tires and the oil changes. Oil changes aren't too bad, especially when you get like a regular truck model. Um, the um, I had just thinking of some expenses to try not to have any dead time for you guys. Trying to make this as quick as possible. Um, there's so much stuff that we wanted to do for it, but we always had that "what if it breaks down." Uh, it is expensive to stay at parks, and we don't have a generator. We don't have a running generator. That's one of the things we never fix. So it, when it got cold out, we were resorting to staying in the parks. Parks are expensive. Um, it's even, like, they rival rent. 
Um, I, I like boondocking and I like going out in the desert or camping grounds and off-season camping. And you can save money there. But, um, all in all, it, it there is kind of, I if we would have got the repairs, we could have saved some money. But we found out, like, it's a good thing we didn't do it because we have a cracked manifold anyways in this generator. So just going to end up buying another one here. I'm actually parked now. I'm at the end of two years. The registration is actually coming up do this month at the end of this month i might go one last small trip before it's over but or i just might renew it and go back on another adventure um planning on going now this is the goal this is what i want to transition to from struggling and still working and having that set job and really the free time not being as like i want to travel and go places i want to do things i want to show people what the life is out there on the road what all these states are and i'm actually going to make it a challenge to myself to go to all 50 states i'm going to do another two-year trip i'm going to do it without a job um i'm going to do it with temp jobs i will still work temp but i'm not going to have a permanent job unless i can find some traveling gig um i'm going to show people how to like this youtube channel i'm going to try to build up like i don't want to monetize it but I'm going to show you, and I might even put links down below, um, I probably should, uh, give me some five bucks on some of these things, how to make money on Fiverr, um, things that I've done to build up, and I actually made a Twitter network, and I've talked about it before, I want to show how I use that to make money, um, using advertising, uh, I'm going to get into showing people how to do, like, stuff that can be idly done, and I'm going to try to make everything automated as possible. Um, the, my whole goal is, in financial freedom, is to be able to make something out of nothing, more, more or less. Set it and forget it. Let it go. And it just keeps making money. Um, there's also, I contract out, basically that's what I use Fiverr for, uh, if people want stuff on, like, people want to blow up a hashtag or something, they come on there and they're like, hey, I want you to post these posts. Okay. I, I put them out, I give them a thousand posts or whatever. Um, I don't mind doing that, it's kind of arduous, I would say. I'm about to streamline it, make it easier. So that's going to be kind of cool, I'm going to be making videos on all this, um, we're going to make money together, hopefully, if um, if you follow me. Um, if not, we might all fail together, but I'm going to try to be true to my word. I'm going to show, I'm going to try to affiliate everything I do. Like, I don't want, like, I was working, trying to selling and affiliate stuff, and I decided I only want to affiliate with stuff that I would use. Like, the Fiverr, the, the Crowdfire, um, other things that I use to... Uh, to expand trying to make that simple thing like you're doing something every day and I decided to if it's not making money for you don't do it why do it um like I quit all the video games I play you no World of Warcraft or anything like that no Counter-Strike no freaking matching up blocks Jerry's Bubbles stupid games. I mean, it t turns out, like, I actually, one of the things I want to do, and this might be a longer, more like a five-year plan while traveling, I want to develop a, a game app, actually, about what it, what this is, what this lifestyle is like. It's going to be a little over the top, and I've, uh, I mean, I've already got the design board going, and it's kind of fun. Um, it's either I'm going to have to learn how to program games, which w would be fun. I don't mind learning new things. I'll go back to school. Um, but I want to do this. I want to make this game. Um, it, it seems like, I, I mean, you probably see me getting excited. It would be another way to make an idle income. People always are playing video games. People are always on their phone. Why not make money off of what people are doing? Like, that's why I got into Twitter. People are always on Twitter. I was at the poker table. I'm dealing poker, and I look at all these poker players. They're on freaking Twitter, tweeting back and forth when they're two tables over. It's like, why can't I just squeeze in and sell them some stuff? Or sell their friends some stuff, or something like that. Um, especially since they always have money. Why Why not? It's go where the money's at. Um, bring the money to you. I'm also working on art, I, um, the, which I mention almost every time I'm on a video here. That bed in the back room's going bye-bye. That's going to be an art studio, slash living room, emergency bedroom, whatever. 
I'm going to sleep up back here behind me. Um, that's my favorite place to sleep. Uh, I want to find alternate ways to make money. And, and I want to teach those ways and show how easy it is actually to do it. Um, like working with Etsy and um, Etsy and Pinterest and how they interlink. And then still there's always the blogs. The blogs I don't know yet. I would love to learn. I've seen some stuff where people use the blogs to inflate popularity amongst different things. Which... Who knows? Maybe I might experiment with those. I'm trying. the The goal is is everything I do. I don't want to give money. It's all about bringing the money in. Don't want to spend money. Don't want to play video games and spend money on them. Sorry, <clears throat> got a little bit of hiccups. I want to um, like and do most of this on my phone. Uh, I mean, everybody has a phone. I mean, if you're going to be out and traveling and be independent. The phone's the easiest thing. What if you could do it all without a computer? I do most of my stuff on my phone. Um, I have a laptop here, but... I mean, less you run the generator, the less you have to use gas, the better. I mean, it charges so easy. I have a charge while I'm driving. I charge, like, three batteries while driving. I mean, you drive for six hours, you charge everything. Um, make little hops. Like, I want to go from... I want to make be able to make those little hops and make money at rest stops or whatever. If I, I want to take my time. Uh, I don't mind stopping at a love, stopping at a, at a TA, stopping at a rest area, whatever. I I just want to take my time. I want to hit some some nice little tourist traps and film them for people. I don't want to make money. Like I have a GoFundMe, but I don't really want to make money through my GoFundMe. Um, the. Uh, uh, the the whole just giving me money because I need help type thing doesn't really appeal to me. I'd rather go out there and do stuff. Maybe I'm going to start looking at how people fund themselves on YouTube videos or whatnot and maybe find some way to promote some products. I don't mind. I, I Options are endless. Um, once you get the people, it's just a matter of getting the product and getting the right thing. Eight. Hey. I, there's always opportunities, you just have to keep looking, I'm going to keep looking, and I'm going to try to express as best, like, everything's about, this, this is about rebuilding, and for me, it's new beginnings, like, I, I want to better myself at the end of this journey, at the end of this journey, I want to make it to where I'm completely free and independent, uh, that, that's awesome, that's all I want, um, I save a lot of money. I don't spend a, hardly any money. Um, I buy... I'm very simple for foods and whatnot. You... The financial independence and being able to travel... I mean, this thing does not get good gas mileage. It's not like I would... $100 to fill up a 50-gallon tank. I mean... At 9 miles a gallon... Yeah, it doesn't matter if I'm going up the Rockies or across the plains of Kansas. It's nine, nine miles, nine miles per gallon, just like clockwork. Just, I hope, I hope to change that. Maybe downsize eventually. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna pay this off or. I hope to pay it off. If it works out and this journey works out, um, this RV is gonna be paid off. And it will probably be a full working studio for me where I can actually make money, not just by doing YouTube or whatever and uh, click ads or anything like that. I can also do my other stuff that I like to do. Um, because, I mean, in the end, I'll even talk about some of my hobbies. Like, I like doing puzzles. But after I do a puzzle once, it's like, what do you do with the puzzles in the box? And I've actually looked up some really cool art ideas, and I'm totally um, going to bring those to you guys. I'm going to show you um, on YouTube how I do that. I'm probably going to start connecting that with Pinterest or whatever else I need to, and I'm going to start selling art. Uh, basically, cut and dry, that's what it is. It's really simple. People are like, oh my gosh, artsy stuff. Artists get a bad rap. Um, there's a lot of small, simple things that you can make. Even, yeah, it's actually cool. 
Um, I, I can't wait to bring that to you. And that's going to be another thing. I'm going to totally bring how to do that, how to sell that stuff, how to sell. Like I get in there. I like to paint. I like to draw. I mean, I goof around most of the time, but I, I really like to paint and draw. So if I start getting serious and actually painting some paint, some actual works of art, you know, whatever that may be, and framing it up and selling it. It's pretty much my works of art, whatever it is anybody is going to buy. Um, <coughs> it, I, got, I got plenty of storage space for that now. I, I didn't before, but I got tons now. I totally emptied this RV out. This is going to be a money-making machine. Uh, you can ship You can ship from anywhere in the United States. UPS store. I mean, I, I can just make money while rolling, and... I know this is getting on to 15 minutes here on this video. Uh, I just wanted to talk about different ways that I was going to make money and how I learned to make money. I think that's... I pretty much hit on everything that, um, that I'm planning on doing. And everything that I've learned-ish. Like, I mean, having that constant job... And knowing that every three months I, I was going to show, show up somewhere and pitch cards. But then I'd have like two month break or a month break or three month break. How do I do that? And how do, and then I go start and work, and I work at other places that I don't like, that are the same job. Uh, I, I would rather be a temp employee and just do work every now and then. I like actually doing physical labor. Sorry, I don't like sitting in a chair pitching cards. It's boring to me. Um, yeah, get me out in the sunlight. <laughs> Anyways, I think I'm going to wrap it up here. I think I hit on most of the things that in the future we're going to be making money off of. We're going to try to make this into a money-making RV. Um, also modifi modifications coming. I'll probably post a video up about that. Doing some, I'm probably going to take some before and after videos and tice those up and put them together or whatever. I'm going to get better at making videos and stuff that's one of my goals um i'm just trying to get into the normal habit of putting up something that's less than 20 minutes i don't really care what i put it on watch my videos i don't care just because you watch these videos doesn't mean you're gonna watch the other videos um i'm gonna put a lot of stuff out i'm gonna have fun with this this is my thing i have unlimited data woohoo I'm going to teach you how to pay off all your unlimited data on your phone and live pretty much on that. I, I, I mean, I'm, I wish I had it in here to where I can make it to where this whole cabin, eventually that's another thing that's going to be on here about the modifications, solar panels and stuff, getting this thing to run without gas. Um, not the whole car, not the, the whole cabin. Um, anyways, I think I'm done tripping over myself here on the way out. Thank you for watching. If you made it through the whole video, um, hopefully I'm bringing something entertaining, and you're not just watching some boring monotone speaker. Um, more videos to come. This is just the beginning. I can't wait to take you guys out, and we actually go do stuff. I'm already plotting, plotting. <laughs> All right, you guys have an amazing day, year, millennia, whatever. Someone's going to watch this video like 13 years from now and go, Wow, he knew something there. He got into an RV and got out of the city in time. <laughs> All right, peace, guys.